What is going on guys, it's Raul from the Win Central and in this video I'll be showing you how to bypass or disable Windows lock screen on Windows 10. Uh, while I don't have any complaint with the lock screen, uh, some people find it annoying, uh, some people find it counterproductive because uh, you know, uh, uh, when a PC wake up from sleep, you need to have, uh, I mean, you need to click on the lock screen in order to have this sort of uh, rectangular box where you usually uh, type your password, where you usually put the password in order to log into your PC. And if you are like uh, having a, I mean, if you are, if you own a Surface computer, if you own a touch PC, um, like Surface or HP Elite, uh, uh, I think the Elite Book or, and, and stuff like that. So you need to swipe the uh, the lock screen or in order to have this uh, sort of uh, the rectangular box where you, you'll, you'll put the I mean you'll type the password and then log into the um, you know log into the log into your PC. So you, you know guys, it uh, for some people uh, it uh, you know have it has this sort of hindrance. Uh, you have this sort of extra layer, um, you know. Uh, so uh, there is a way to bypass that. Uh, and if you are one of them who finds it uh, counterproductive, who finds it uh, like a, uh, like a hindrance, finds it uh, uh, annoying, this video is for you guys. So uh, without further ado, let's just dive into it, shall we? So in order to um, disable or uh, bypass the Windows uh, lock screen on Windows 10, uh, all I need to do is I need to uh, go to... Um, I need to type uh, like I need to go to the uh, Windows search and then I need to type regedit.exe. So I need to type regedit.exe. So I type r e g e d i t dot e x e. So you'll see I have this uh, um, UI. So I'll I'll just open it. I need to click on yes, and I need to go to this. Uh, H key underscore local underscore machine. So I double click on it. I click on software. I mean, I double click on software. I then I need to find policies. So where is policies? All right, policies, policies. Okay, I have policies here. I'll double click on it again. I double click on it. I need to go to Microsoft and then I need to go to, um, I need to click on double click on Windows. So I double click on Windows, and uh, this see um, I have this sort of uh, lot of lot of, um, of files or whatever it is. So you don't have to do anything here. You need just left click on um, Windows, and you need to uh, create a new key. So I create a new key here, and I need to uh, name it as personalization. So I name it as personalization. So I name it personalization all right and guys do remember one thing that these are case sensitive to, so don't put uh, a capital P here so all is uh, you know you need to uh, type this as all, all the letters as small letters so uh, personalization with uh, caps lock off so do remember that so I uh, save it i just click on enter and you see i have this sort of uh, personalization uh, key all i need to do now is that uh, you need i need to click on i need to left click on this blank space uh, here like here anywhere i can click on here i can click on here anywhere so uh, let me just uh, left click on uh, this sort of uh, blank space i left click on it and then i create this uh, uh, d word uh, value I click on it D word uh, value and uh, I need to name it as no lock screen so I click on no lock screen I, I type no lock screen so let me type that no lock screen okay okay guys so um, as the case uh, as it was in case of personalization, personalization, you need to uh, do the same thing with with uh, no lock screen. So uh, these are case sensitive. So I type, uh, uh, you know, I type no lock screen with uh, N as capital, uh, O as small, L as capital, O C K small letters, 
are s capital letters and uh, the rest of the letters are small so you need to do that and there is no space uh, in between like among these words so you need to uh, like uh, like a sum it up right so no lock screen and uh, then you need to press enter so the button like uh, like the button is created all you need to do is uh, like uh, um, you know you need to uh, click double click on here no lock screen and there you'll see you have this sort of pop-up like value data and there you need to uh, set this as on like uh, you need to set this value um, uh, zero uh, it was zero need to uh, type it as one and you need to click on ok um, now if you uh, like uh, put 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 in a sleep uh, I mean if you if you uh, put the uh, I mean if you put your PC into sleep uh, and then wake then then again wake up um, you'll find that you you no longer have the lock screen right um, you'll uh, directly you'll be redirected to the to the to, to that rectangular box where you usually put your password and um, if you're not uh, like if you uh, revert your decisions so what do you do uh, you need to go to the this the settings personalization and then uh, you need to double click on no lock screen and then you need to again uh, set the value to zero so if you uh, set the value to zero and then click on ok then uh, you'll again have uh, the lock screen so you can set this on off uh, whatever you want it's sort of uh, like a like a uh, like a switch it, it it acts as a switch where you need to just on and off so that is it where zero is for like a false uh, and one is for true so it's like sort of computer science knowledge basic stuff and uh, so i hope you get the uh, get what i'm saying right so if you find the video helpful do share it guys and uh, if you like the video do hit the like button and do subscribe to this channel for more cool videos with like this uh, with this we have uh, come to uh, the end of this video and on this i'd call it a wrap and i shall see you in the next one bye bye and take care